Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we show you how we turn this into this. So we will be changing some light fitting features. But before taking any uh, electrical work in your place, please follow some safety measures. This video is for guideline only and if you need uh, specific details, please get in touch with uh, a qualified electrician. Remember to subscribe, give us a like so we can keep producing video like this. With no further ado, let's get started. Now we're going to make sure that uh, the lighting system in the house is switched off by uh, switching off here on the consumer unit uh, putting that off on the lighting system and uh, to make sure that everything is off you can even check on the, um, the light you can see here it's not lighting anymore so that we can start working on, uh, on the light it's not this one but it's uh, the one next to it okay for this project these are the material I will be needing I will need uh, uh, a step ladder because uh, uh, the light is on the ceiling and it's a bit high so uh, to reach it I need uh, a step loader I will need screwdrivers uh, a battery one um, I will need um, a manual screwdriver uh, the general purpose but I will also need an electrical uh, screwdriver a tester this one uh, to test that uh, the area that where you are working is not uh, doesn't have any electricity so it's uh, for safety we also need uh, here some uh, wire stripper uh, to, uh, to cut uh, the wire and we also need uh, in here a multi-purpose detector to detect that the area where you are working doesn't have any metal wire electricity so it's very good it's also for safety soft safety measures so let's jump into it let me show you what needs to be done now. Uh, we can start unboxing. And to double check, we need a, a tester, electric, electrical uh, screwdriver, just, just to check that there is no electricity before any uh, disconnection. You can see there is no electricity here, so we can safely start in removing them. Before removing anything, uh, it's better to take a picture of uh, the connection so you remember exactly where things were so that uh, when you put the new system on you know exactly where to connect before before any of this uh, this project if you're not sure of what to do just uh, get a professional an electrician, a qualified electrician to do the job. But follow the instructions of uh, what is mentioned so that uh, uh, the job is done safely. And as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, this video is for guidelines only. So if you want uh, a, a, the job done like this, you can get an electrician to do that for you. You can see here that the wire has different color. It's good to know uh, the meaning of those colors. So uh, the green and yellow, you can see that here, means is the earth. 
the palm here means his life is where the electricity goes uh, actually so and the, the the blue one is neutral these are for new uh, housing or new regulation for older housing is different for older housing you may find that is uh, is red instead of uh, brown for life and uh, for neutral you may find that is uh, is black uh, instead of blue so bear that in mind also and you can also see um, on the, the new uh, light system uh, uh, some uh, symbols L you know is life is the palm one and you can see neutral is N and it's a blue one and the earth is uh, has the earth symbols so on the uh, on where you will be connecting um, your wire. start connecting Here what we did, we did we did the marking where we're gonna draw but before doing that we need to test that area because the way it is it's on the joint on the ceiling so we need to make sure that there's no electricity in this area so we need to, to test the area using a, a multi-purpose detector. See when we are closer, this means there's electricity. Now let's uh, check close where we're gonna throw if there's nothing. We can see here there's nothing, so we can throw there is safe to do so, and also here is safe to do so. We're gonna throw there. Here is too close. Now it's fine. We can throw where the mark will be. And also here is too close and now now it's fine so we're gonna also draw over over there so where we put the four marks is where we're gonna draw and there is no sign that uh, have any electricity or wire or metal in that area so it's safe to do so okay I just move my finger closer yeah now it's uh, now it's fine exactly where where it is where the dot is we're gonna start working because of the dust so the way to protect the floor is uh, this is how we found we're gonna use this uh, uh, protection so there's no dust on the on the floor
have uh, been assembled. So it's fixed on the, on the ceiling. Now we need to fix how to put together the lights and uh, test the system. But we can see now it's fixed on the hole. So on the ceiling, I mean. So that's good. Now the fitting is uh, is done. We uh, it's a lovely uh, light uh, fitting system, and uh, with the crystal. Now we need to uh, put the bulb in to see how it lights. But uh, now the job is uh, almost done. That's all. Now we are fitting the LED bulb. This uh, J9 uh, LED filament light is a very low consuming and it's A++, which is good. Energy saving. Okay, the light has been fit now. Now we uh, we need to uh, turn on the on the consumer unit the fuse, and then we're gonna test that everything is working. So let's do it now. Okay, the fuse must have been turned on. Uh, now let's uh, switch on the light to see if everything is working. Uh, let's do the test now. You can see it's very, it's a beautiful set. Let's test the light again to see how it's working. This is a beautiful setting and it gives nice color to the room. Thanks guys for watching the video, uh, the project is now completed and um, you, we hope you enjoyed the, uh, the video or maybe learned something. Um, please remember to, to subscribe, give us a like so we can continue producing videos uh, like this one. So thanks again for watching and uh, see you for the next one. Thanks, bye.